Unloader, see what it does. See if it's working. What is it working? Touch it. Touch it. Yeah, like, just barely, barely. Like just the green? Yeah. Touch it again. Catch again. <laughs> Alright, here's the milk car. Now watch it. Pretty good? Yeah, pretty good, yeah. Now we'll see if I can. happens. They come out? Yep. Nice. Come out nice? Yeah. Is it working? No, it's just chucking them on the ground side. See if I can make some legs. Already have a bunch of nice pieces made. See if I can notch them so they can slide up into and around the corners. That's the strategy. Let's see if I can notch these out so I can cut in, cut in. Eventually, there's the idea. Let's take this leg. And slide it up inside. Let's see if we get enough of stability the whole way around. Might work, might not. We'll try one, see what happens. See if we can cut some square holes. See what we can do. Get this thing even work. Oh yeah. There we go. Some legs. Still gonna have to line them with some some felt. Maybe a tightener from inside. Right now the table is completely standing on the four corners. I think I'm gonna put one in the middle. I do have some other cupboards underneath. Pretty close. In case something isn't happy, it'll only go down like half inch maybe. But anyway. Something I have to experiment with, see what I can do. Mortise and machine work pretty nice for making nice big square cutouts. Let's take a look at one of these. A lot of stuff over here. Oh no, a little sheep. That was a little little survivor he was inside the mountain whenever I was removing some of the garbage that was something that was in there from years ago who knows how many years ago surely at least 30 maybe 40 or 50 and there's also a little pop tab of course that was underneath my boy came around he noticed that he said daddy what's this Pepsi thing I said, that was in the mountain. That's just something that's going to stay with the layout one way or another. Not sure how. But anyway, these corners, since there's another cupboard underneath, I can lift this up maybe. And the corner will come right out. Let's see? There we go. I'm going down just a little bit. So anyway... Put a nice corner, a lot of one block. I'll line that with felt later on, otherwise it's going to scuff the paint off pretty readily. And by lining it with felt, it'll firm it up a little bit. I might put a little screw from inside to put some a little bit of pressure against, maybe from both directions, in different height. And we'll see. All right, so if I can get this back on here, a little trickier than you think. Of 
course gravity helps <laughs> helps to put it on so anyway I'm not sure what height I'm gonna make it yet I obviously can cut off whatever amount I want to might put some fancy I think I kind of need to put a little fancy cap on this of some sort we'll see the transformer is really close so I just had to really just cut this off the slightest amount but anyway, it's in there. One step closer. Got some milk cars working today.